Hello and welcome to another episode of Smack That Shit, aka how to get better at golf quicker. Jimmy Tropicana Manolo is going to play an entire golfing hole, no editing, and you're going to get into our minds on how to get better at golf quicker. So take it easy and check it out. Okay, first spot. We have a 360 yard par four. You can absolutely nuke a driver up and guess what happens? Let's say you hit a 300. Do you know how to flip a little 49 yard wedge? Do you know how? Probably not. You don't practice, you have kids and stuff. You need to get to full swing stuff. So let's start thinking, how do I get to another full swing? Well, I have a driving iron, two iron. It's probably like 18 degrees. Get yourself something like this that you can make sure gets into the fairway. Check it out. I get up, I tee the ball. I'm on the right side of the tee box because I like to hit a little cut. So I aim it out there and it fades off to the right. It's a great shot to have. Here we go. Uh, uh, good. And then, sun, uh, good. Now you get behind the ball, pick your tarche. Three, two, one, ash. Oh yeah, that's it. Okay, good, boom. I got my foots, it's nasty. Waggle that shit, check it out. And then watch the claw hit the ball, man. Smack that shit, that's it. Ooh, hoo, hoo. boom, Pure. on balance. You saw it? It's up there? Yeah. Perfecto, no? Perfect. Good. Great shot. The goal is to get it in the grass, which we just did. That's it. His turn. How to get good at golf fast? How about how to get better at golf quickly? Here's the number one thing. He had a driving iron. That's great. I have a three iron. You can hit a driver. You can hit whatever you feel comfortable with. Here's the number one thing that people do. They try to hit it too hard. If you ask most amateur golfers, hey, are you good with a pitching wedge? What do they say? Yeah, I'm good from 115 yards. Uh -huh. well, why are you swinging your three iron any different than a pitching wedge? There's this no thing's need. designed to go the distance that it's supposed to go. So I look at this thing and it is a three iron, but I hit it like a pitching wedge. It's just physics. There's a million miles of grass over there. Million? Well, million trillion. Just oh. hit it on the grass and swing like you have a pitching wedge in your hand. Perfect. It goes up and over and I'm safe. Now, most people can't even do that because they're trying to hit it on the green. Mm -hmm. Did I roast it? No. Nope. nope. But guess what? You're over the water. I'm over the water. I'm You're on grass. On grass. And, and a I lot have... of people, I do, they do do this. This is probably you. And then here it comes. Right there. You start to look. And the second you look, your body races, you top it, you blade it, and you thin something into the water, and now it is a pure disaster. Did you say Utah? Like the Utah? jazz? Utah? Yeah, you said Utah like three times. You top no, no. it, you it's, look it's, it. It's Johnny Utah from Point Break. You never seen it? 1997 Utah Jazz, Stockton Malone, the mailman. Yeah, no, they were great, but I was talking about Johnny Utah. Do you think Post Malone is named after Carl Malone, the mailman? No, I think he's named after the post office. Well, what about the post office is the mailman? No, the post office came before the mailman, bro. It's like the chicken and the egg. It came before. The postman, Post Malone. Carl Malone was the post. Man. So Post Malone came post Carl Malone. Do you think he's named after that? I'm having a moment. <laughs> okay, look. Thing. Oh, I got to drive through the... This is what that means. Go in here. Now, you hit your ball 100 yards past mine. Sort of. But guess what? What? I'm on grass. That's all that matters. And if I'm playing as a 20 handicap, mm -hmm. I'm on grass and I'm good. I'm 169 yards away. Absolutely perfect. Give Manolo Spielberg the cover. Now I'm going to take a seven iron. I hit a 170 yard shot. Maybe I should hit, look, I'm going to do this. I hit my seven iron 170 yards. Okay. I'm going to hit a six iron because yeah. I'm going to smooth it yeah. as if I had a pitching wedge. And all I'm going to do is keep this on the grass. I have a question for you, if yes. you don't mind. Yes. Are you factoring in the crazy uphill extra for the viewers? No, I, I'm, I'm playing this as if I all I want to do is just keep the ball on grass. Got it. Got it. Okay. I'm just trying to keep the ball on grass. I'm not trying to make a birdie here. I have a pitching wedge in my hand, in my head. Oh, oh. wow. I have a pitching wedge in my hand, yeah. in my head. Wow. And all I want to do is swing it like a pitching wedge from 120 yards away. If all else fails, I'm going to movie productions. I'm such a good cameraman. Watch this. I have a pitching wedge. I'm just going to hit it up there. 
<laughs> oh, it's so good. Is that get up shot, there? Honestly, you ever hear in your life? That's <laughs> <laughs> so good, bro. I'm telling you, it's easy. I had a pitching. I told you, I had a pitching wedge in my hand. Everybody says I can hit a pitching wedge 150 yards, but when I get far from the green, I can't. Just pretend you have a pitching wedge. Primo, I was so enamored by that that the camera at work might have been terrible. I spoke too soon. Oh. And, and no, 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 it's great. Spielberg Manolo. I know, huh? but it's great. But the fact that you're doing these in Cash Money Birdman Reebok glasses is really, really nice. I, I took my golf shoes off you, to you, prove. You slipped the touch, but you kept it on it. it, 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 it have you ever seen uh, Scheffler swing? He, he, he's got three inch spikes and his feet are sliding all over him. It doesn't matter. It really doesn't. It's the mental. Did you make it? Did I? Hostia, joder. Oh my God, if I made it. Digas. <laughs> okay, tell me what you're at. Oh, Andale, no, perro. Estás a cuatro pies. It says 126. Okay. 126. I'm telling you, listen, we're going to do this for the sake of doing this. 126. How many people go straight to pitching wedge? How many? Everybody. Everybody? 126. Yep. Pitching wedge, no matter what. Yep. Come on, Mike. This thing is above my feet a little bit, and it's a little bit uphill. There's a little more ritmo. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to club up. We're going to take a three-quarter swing. I clubbed up. And we're going to choke down. Club up, choke down. Mm -hmm. Club up, choke down. Because you over here thinking that, oh, I'm going to put it right there. What is that disgusting? Oh, I'm going to get it all the way up in here like that. And I'm going to get a ton of it because the club is longer. Come on, man. That's not it. Get some control. Club up, choke down. Club up, choke down. Get 126 yards. You're hitting what? I'm going to do a nine iron. Wow. Nobody does that. Nobody. Manola does it. Club so, up, choke down. It's all about accuracy. What's your main goal right here? What, what do you want to do? I, I'm going to zoom in right here so they can see. You see a massive green on the left, but yeah. you also see bunkers on the left. So wh where are you aiming here? What's the common denominator? The ball is above my feet, which means it's going to go with the Earth's contour. It's mm. very deep. So if that's the case, the ball's going to come this way. So if I were to aim at the flag and I don't quite hit it so good, it could go in that bunker. Mm. So I'm going to aim at the right edge of the green, let the natural movement of the Earth Take the golfing ball where I want it to go. And my only thing that I'm thinking, swear to goodness, is to watch the club, hit the ball. I'm going to sit back and watch the club, hit the ball. That's what I think. Everything else, just whatever it is, it is. Okay. Okay. I'm going to do a 360 so everybody can see where we're at. Look at that. Wow. There's okay, ready? a lake in the middle of the desert. What do you know? Let's see what happens. Okay, Manny. Aim a little right. Yeah. Right there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Life happens. Let's keep it going. So here's what we do when that takes place. We go to our golfing clubs and golfing bag and grab a golfing ball and hit a provisional because sometimes you don't do it quite like you like it. All okay. right. So you hit it out of bounds. You yep. have to hit a provisional. Okay. You might not find it. Okay. So uh -huh. here's what you do. Come over here, get it by your knee. The same spot you were just at, you drop it and Got you it. go through the same ritmo again. Nothing, hey, whatever. You might find it, but in case you don't, it's in play. I actually see it. You just didn't see it. It just it, it kicked a little left. And Guess what? Left of the Guess carpet. what? A lot of people are going to go up there and then have to come back. And have to I understand. All the way back. I get it. You got it. I Same got it. thing. Now let's do it correctly. That's a provisional. I exactly. Love it. Do it correctly. No problems. Oh, that's beautiful. Okay. Watch the club hit the ball. Hold your finish and boom. Oh my God! You made it. So, here's the mission. If you skanky, skanky, put it into the desert, and you don't think you might find it or something like that, get a ball, drop it, by your knee, right here, hit a professional. It's necessary. Okay. So, you don't have to come back and slow up the game. I heard that. I heard you. I heard you. You hear me? You don't have to yell at me. I already well, know this. I'm very passionate. Because sometimes... I, I see your ball, though. <laughs> well, at the beginning, I did it. Okay. And you, oh, I see it. Maybe you saw like something fly out of the trees and you're wrong. It hit on the right side a little bit and came. If you can tell, there's a hill right here. So everything just funnels down. Okay. So it hit a little bit. 
I've seen you see things, and sometimes you don't see like what you think you saw. I see it. Dude. I see it. Dude. Look at these balls, though. Wait, hold on. Let me zoom in real quick. Look at these balls right here. Wow. Yeah. So those are our two shots. Okay. And there's your ball right there, dude. It's absolutely perfect. Okay. So there's our there, there's your provisional ball. There's your original ball. Okay. So it came out great. Fantastic. It comes off of this and just... All right. I see. I didn't see that. So yeah. that's on me. Whatever. Okay, should I move the golf cart or do you want to hit while the golf cart is like... No, right no. There? You should definitely move. Okay. Let me move it. Oh. Okay. Okay. Check it out. Everybody at home. Oh, here we go. Look at this. Two clubs. Can you zoom in? That's it. 60. And a 56. 56. Okay. How many of you are going to grab a 60 right now, right away? That's it. I would. Everybody. Everybody would. Okay. The game of golf is going to be around forever. I want you to start learning how to use your 56 and your 54 for so many of these shots. Unless it's an emergency situation, I'm talking 911, SOS, okay? The Porsche 911, 911, that's 911. I'm not in an emergency. I'm not. I'm going to use my 56. 56, huh? I don't have to do nothing. I don't have to do anything crazy or special. All I want to do is this. Hit a shot that lands right here and then just feeds to the hole. I'm not trying to fly it all the way to the hole. You are not that guy. So it's leave fun. it short and let it roll down. I mean, yeah, think about Anywhere it. on the green is good, right? Exactly. Give yourself a chance at par. Yes. So my mission, bounce it up there, have it feed. That's what I see the earth doing. Okay. That's all I'm going to try to do. I like it. So my little practice swing is going to be for that move. Okay. Good. 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 And you don't have to do nothing. You just get it going. Fantastic. I like it. Let's see it. Hit your spot. Hit it. Ooh. Okay. Your mind said, I got to fly it. I got to spin it. I got to. Did you see the Mars, bro? <laughs> That's the space station right there. Look at that. What is that? Uh, it's mountains and like oasis. Oasis. So, so all I did was made good contact, sort of. Got the ball to my spot, let it roll. You don't have to be a pro. Pros are pros. Mm. You're not dunking like the pros, mm. so don't dunk. Just hit a little jump shot. Come on, Mike. Okay. Use the backboard. Yeah, like the OGs. All right. This is a good episode. I like it. A lot of golf is happening. I'm feeling very, very passionate. So you have a par putt. Uh-huh. That was your provisional ball. That's my original ball there. Mm-hmm. So I... Ugh. You what? It's easy. I, I hit a three iron off the tee, and I, I didn't even hit it hard. That's you. That's me back there. That's provisions. That's your provisional ball, so you can pick that up. That's you there. Uh-huh. Now, I'm going to set this right here. I'm going to show you what I'm thinking right here, because it's a perfect view. This is how to get good at golf quickly. Pull that flag out. Let's crook it and stick it. That's the hole. Mm-hmm. That's not where I want to hit it. There's a jacuzzi that starts right there oh. and a jacuzzi that ends right here. Ooh. There Ooh. and there. And it's a giant jacuzzi How and many? there's people in there. How many? Three. Five. Oh, that's a there's lot of people. There's five people, people in sitting in here mine. drinking Miller High Life. And all I want to do. Mine are drinking Corona Premier. I, okay, well, I, I just want to put my ball in the jacuzzi. Okay. I, I, I'm not even trying to make this. I don't think about it too much. All I think about is. Which way is the ball going to go? I see it going this way a lot. Uh -huh. So I just want to take the ball and roll it in the jacuzzi. I like that. And it just looks something like that. Just roll it in there. I don't want to make this. I'd be upset if I made this. I'd be happy if it went in the jacuzzi. Take it easy. Take it easy. Take it easy. Is that it? Yeah, I mean, that's, 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 your foot is in the water for sure. Now I'm just going to finish. Uh -huh. I'm going to hit the ball to right here. Just tap it and keep my head down. Move in. That was the easiest four. 
it, it's it's when you try to do a lot uh -huh. when you try to hit the ball really far uh -huh. and you try to be a superstar you're not a superstar no you're not dominic wilkins yeah just just make a four and go to the next freaking hole how many people's like dominic wilkins go look at his highlights <laughs> a ver. all right you have a four opportunity okay. as well now here's something i noticed mm. when the ball was coming off of this hill and rolled this way mm -hmm. I noticed that it stayed on this side of the hole. Mm. Did you notice that? It didn't like curve in. So that leads me to believe that the ball might not want to go that much that way. I keep that in my mind. It's the little things. I'm paying attention to the movie for sure. Okay. Another thing. That's the top of the hill, you know? Looks like it. And that's the bottom. I see water and I see some stuff down here. So right away, Manolo knows. Wow. That's an uphill putt. I got to give it a little more Ugh. massa. Okay. A little more gasoline. So you're saying this, you you know it's an uphill putt. Uh-huh. And you know it's going to stay right of the hole. Uh, No, it, it's going it's to stay. It's going to break. Right. It's probably going to stay on the same side of the hole that it came down the hill. It's not going to break to the right. It's probably going to stay this way. That's what I'm telling you. Oh. So I'm going to line this perro up. Oh, so you don't see it going left? Not at all. Oh, okay. Only off of what I saw on the hill. So this to me looks like a now a straight putt because oh, I wow. was going to play it, but now it's just like, ah, it's probably straight. Okay. Ooh, I believe the you. dreaded straight putt, man. Okay, my line looks pretty straight, pretty good, pretty nasty. Okay, I have my line. My only job. That's what the line is for you at home. When you see the pros putting the line, that's it. They are putting it on the line they wanted to get on. And now your only job is to roll the line end over end with good speed. Now, this guy's in a jacuzzi with five people. I'm trying to put it into the hole or very close because I'm a great putter. So I'm going to try it. Okay. I'm positive. Pars are great. I'm not crazy. Pars are great. Bogies are okay, but double bogies are no go. So exactly. all you want to do is make sure you don't make double sure. bogey. So let's don't put a good smoke stroke. it past the hole. Let's put a good stroke. Keep my head still. Let it all happen. That's it. Okay, good and good. Let's see what happens. A little bit up, so give it a little bit of gasoline. Now that's it. Oh, you see? No. It you stayed see? right. You I were told you. you were totally right. So I took all of my data and it was like, okay, it stayed, stayed, it stayed, it stayed, it stayed. It actually came a little this way. So listen, whatever mine. Boom one, boom two, three to there. Four to there. Everyone can do this for five. Listen, if you're going to play the game of golf, you want to play it pretty quickly, pretty smart, but you don't have to think so crazy. Just do a couple little things that is going to make you, what is it called? Play golf better, play golf quicker, and learn how to play golf so much nastier. Because on Smack That Shit, that's what we do, and that's it.